Good morning, this is SOS and my son Ernie. We're up here, we're just gonna do a short hike with our backpacks. We're an averaging right now 20 liters. We're up here. Okay, get back to you, see how we do. And I forgot my tracking pole, so I'm using leg muscles. Ooh, hopefully it's not slippery. Okay, dog, get back to you. I thought you were going to say SOS signing off. We thought that was a bear. Holy moly. Trying out these other hookahs that are more my size. Not hocus. Oh my god, what kind of shoes do I got? Ultra, ultra, ultra. Oh lord, dementia is kicking in for this old lady. <laughs> oh lordy, lack of oxygen is kicking my brain. I didn't bring my trekking poles so you can feel the difference. What do you feel on your hands? It's flowing down there. That little stream crosses, I think, right there, the trail. Right over here. Right somewhere around right there. So let's keep going. Ooh wee. I think the backpack makes a difference. It's about 20 pounds. But I think my backpack's too small now. I'm like the freaking Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Can't find the right size. Just like I had technical difficulties getting a bike my size, a road bike. Thanks to Ruth, works at Stevens. She took care of that problem. Got me a perfect bike which I did my first century in. So this should be a piece of cake. Come on, Mary. You can ride 100 miles on your bike. You can walk 20 a day. Stream crossing. We haven't seen water here in years. Goes all the way down. Oh my God, river crossing. Ah. Look at that. Here, it's a little stream, but some of the, it caved in. I, mean, I don't think it'll go too far back there if it does. See how people get around for the trail. Just make a little extra trail. I don't think there'll be any other streams on top because of the elevation of it. No, I mean, I just never seen a stream. <laughs> I think this is the only stream that I've seen before, but it was always dry. And I think right up there too, where it goes down where that rock's at, those two rocks.
Got a little stream that kind of in the cave. So hopefully if this oh, part doesn't board. give out. Kind of like got to hop over it. Frosted. I mean, if it does rain more, that part would probably, <clears throat> yeah. Look at all this frost. Ice cream. Oh, my legs feel so much better. Here's part of the trail. That's why we think that maybe over at San Joaquin River Gorge, there has to be little parts of the trail that probably got washed away so this is a hop skip and a jump away A lot of noticeable deterioration on the trail. A lot of crumbling from all the rain. But nobody's complaining. Just showing you. I don't know how San Joaquin River Gorge is. That had littler shore, more narrow. We have encountered rocky terrain and muddy right there. Oh, gotta watch your up up your footing because you don't want to damage oh that piece of dirt just crumbled down oh dang shit that's why i didn't want to go to some walking river gorge because I don't know what damage has been done with the trail. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, bug. There's a lot of parts here that seem like they're ready to slide off if we were to get another big storm. Very dangerous. Oh, this is very wet. Almost to the top. Gotta take off this jacket. I came without it. Sent my son back because I was too cold. Now it's too hot. See you in a bit because I gotta wash my feet. a difference without trekking poles. Whoa, muddy. Beautiful snow. Guess we got this tree that got uprooted. That's why that rain we got good but gotta be careful out there in these trails gotta go around it uh, 
think I'll go this way. Ugh. Oh, gotta be careful. Yep. We have reached the top. We're not going any further. I'm trying out these shoes. Forgot my trekking poles. Gonna have a snack up here. Go back down. I'm gonna go to the gym to do some weights. Take a hot shower there. That way I don't have to pay for it. Don't have to worry about the bill. The electric bill, gas bill. There's a lot of crack here. And not that kind of crack. I'm just scared to step on this side. Plus, you never know when the hillside wants to go. It might just take that extra pound to slide right off. And I'm not just another pound. Quite a few pounds. Maybe I get scared too easy. Who knows? Look at that. This site seems like it's sunk. We reached the top. Pink cushion up there. We're not going over there. We're gonna head down right now in a bit. Pink cushion up there. Don't know if I was blocking the speaker. Uh, we have reached the top. I'm gonna take a little break here. My calves are dying. I did not bring my trekking poles. <sighs> There's a trail, but some of it is too close to the edge. I'm not going to walk it right now until it dries out. Because it's still pretty wet out here. It's not worth the risk. I'll just wait. There we go. See you in a bit. This is SO1. Oh, there's people right there. <laughs> <laughs> the, the people behind me. <laughs> I got that off a bit. <laughs> Good morning. Because they're coming right here. My mom, that's where my mom yelled. Oh my God. It's so loud. Look how nice it looks. Nice and green. Once summer comes, it's all dead. Dried up. Hear the wind. Feels so nice after climbing. It's a little snack time. Gonna be fat. And then uh, head back down because I still gotta go home, make my lunch. I think my mom's gonna head to the gym. Uh, this counts as my gym, but I'm going to take tomorrow. Let me see, can I zoom in on that boat? Where, where is it? There it goes. Crap. Is that? Yeah, it is. How'd you get the boat? Oh, there it is. Oh, my cell phone. Oh my god, that's so bright. The bird doesn't stop. Yeah, that one back there. The one that I was talking about. That one that goes over there on top of the hill? Oh, see, That's can I? Have to do all the way no, I can't. <laughs> no, it was, I got a pickle. I got a pickle. I got we're heading back down. We had a little break right here. Next time we're going to go on the trail, but trying out our backpacks. It's an average of 19 pounds each backpack. We got most of our gear in there. So now we're headed back down. It was 1.3 miles. Not a lot, but it's something. I'm trying out my shoes. Oh, there it is. You know, I can't look up. I get dizzy and scared. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. It's scary. Look at
almost to the bottom. There's the parking where we park our car, right? Right there, in that area. Okay, let's get to the bottom. Let's make sure I don't slide. We're going to end up doing about two and a half miles. But it's good enough. Some parts were slippery because it's muddy. And without my trekking poles, I will not forget them again. Oh, make sure I don't slide. Oh my god. It's muddy. And there's the bathroom. See you at the bottom. On the right side? Yep, it's muddy. We had a little couple of spots where we were slip and slide. Oh. You say on the right side or stay on the left side? I was thinking about the edge. Guess I will walk this way. <laughs> Good job, shoes. Gonna record it in case I land on my ass. And I hope not. Ah. People, don't forget your trekking poles. They really help out. Okay, I made it. All right, see you at the gate. I'll pretend it's a third water cash gate. Okay, you gotta get these cows out the way because they're right there, our gate, our third water cash gate. It's going to be great when we see that third water gate cash or whatever you call it. Okay, let's see these cows. Here comes the other one. Make sure they move off the trail. Uh, uh, oh, let me see. Sprint to the door. Scream and sprint. Huh? Scream and sprint to that gate. Oh, there goes the little ones. Oh, we got to be careful because yeah, maybe I know, I know the mama. Let the little ones go up. Oh, how cute. Yeah, because the mama might get mad. Come on, go up. We got to go. Uh-oh. There goes the baby ones. Come on, cross. Cross. Come on, go up. Go up with your mama. Go up. Up. Come on, go up. Go. Don't want your mama getting mad and charging me. I don't know who you are. Come on, keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Ernie wants to noozle the cow. <laughs> then the noozles. Bye. Yes, we humans. We walk for fun. You walk for a living. Okay. We have done it. See you more at the bottom, getting to the bottom.